Or where are the wild animals at? Guido, meatball. <gasps> Guido, what's up, boy? Ah, the boys, what's up? What's up? I know you missed me. Guido, stop eating his leg. What's up guys, welcome back to another video. So today we're gonna go um, pick up my 2020 Mustang GT from the wrap shop. Got a few things done, got PPF, got rid of the fishbowl, and got a few other things blacked out. If you're in the Maryland, DC, Virginia area, this is the best wrap shop on the East Coast. So make sure you go hit them up, the link will be in the description. Go check them out, they're awesome people, they do perfect work, absolutely nothing gets half-assed by them. Everything is on the point to the T, everything gets taken apart and done the right way. That's why I use them, so in advance, thank you guys for doing a good job, and let's go. Cold start. 85 life. Woo! Just so you guys know, we're picking up the Mustang and we're dropping off the GTR to get redone and something's tinted and Meatball just attacked my leg. Bro, stop fighting each other. Let's run it. So we are in Godzilla, en route to the shop. It's like 15, 20 minutes away, I think, roughly. Might have to have a baby pool on the way there. Make sure GTR is running all right. Baby hit. Was that a I think so. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was pulling so good. Yeah, that was a baby pull um, on low boost. What was this waste gate? I think so. Jesus, I couldn't even see what the speed was or what we were going. I'm about to check that clip. That was pretty nasty. You see how loud it is? Yeah, it got so loud once you stepped into it. It gets violent on me. It got violent. She got real violent, real nasty, real quick. Turbos, baby. Turbos. And that's why the GTR is one of my favorite cars ever made. God, that was violent. And it's not even turned up. Every time I get in this car, I'm going to start crying laughing. It just sounded so good, too. It don't even sound like a V6. It's just violent. We are almost at the shop. We are like two minutes out. We're about to pull up. And... About to go check out how the Mustang looks. And we're gonna drop off this GTR, get some window tint um, for the front windshield, probably like 50%, and do a full um, PPF on the whole entire car. I had it once before, but we're just redoing it because it's kind of old and some spots are peeling. And they didn't do this one before. This car, we got it. My dad got it in 2009 when it first came out. The PPF just hit the market and some guys came to the house and did it. They didn't do that bad of a job, but still 11 years on a car it's not gonna last that long and we just arrived to the back another gtr here two teslas this green is hard i'm gonna go in right now and show you all the cars in there and show you exactly what they did to my 2020 mustang guys the car came out can't even explain perfect is not even the right word so started off the whole car pretty much mainly the main body parts the whole front end some side pieces rockers and the back got the ppf protection film on the whole car the hood the headlights the whole nine you can't even see a mark of the vinyl or the lines on it let me show you the only place where you can see just a little bit but it is a very tricky spot so they have a software for this car when you type it in um 2020 mustang gt etc it will give you a printout of what parts of the car you can do to wrap with the ppf film and they have a spot right here they had some extra might not show up on the camera but line right there because it's a very high impact spot right there and the film that we used for the top of the car it is a gloss black but it's a self-healing one so if any rock chips or anything it will smooth back out over time and onto the back, we do have the um, factory spoiler. I did get that painted. That is not wrapped, and that's gloss black. So definitely they can do that for you. The whole deck lid was redone, and all this, too, was completely wrapped and behind my tag. And the line is right there, but you can't even tell, so it's perfect. So when you're driving down the road, it's not gonna, the tag's not going to beat it up or anything. This room, I'm going to have to get this for my garage. All these lighting, all the lights in here is perfect to... Picks out all the little flaws, but there are none on this car. 
as of now, no rock chips, thank God. But now that we got the um, PPF one here, should stay protected forever. But let's talk about the front end a little bit. They actually had a printout for the front grill also. So all around here, all the, all the every little piece on the front grill is covered by the PPF, except all these little, like whatever you want to call them. I don't think they did the pony because that's going to get ripped off. I hate chrome. And these were also painted too. They are not wrapped. Correct way to do it is to paint them because the wrap is not going to turn out 100%, so they recommended painting it. That's what we did, and then after I get the new badges for the side that are coming in, gloss black, I'm going to bring it back, and they're going to get taken out and rewrapped in the paint protection film. So it's going to, it's going to be really nice. Looks super clean. I'm super happy the way it came out. It's definitely worth the money. In the long run, the car is going to be looking flawless all the time. Just got to wash it off, and... It's gonna stay looking clean. This is Nick, the owner of the shop, and he's gonna talk about a little bit what they did of, with the car. Hey guys, so uh, basically we did everything to Jake's Mustang that we did to his C8 a few months ago. We did some paint protection film, we wrapped some black accents on it, tinted the windows, of course, everyone's first mod. So yeah, it came out really good. We protected the full front with Expel paint protection film, and what that's gonna do is just protect the paint against rock chips and scratches and uh, help cleaning it and uh, you know, moving forward with fresh paint, you know, it's always good to protect that fresh paint. You put how many miles in the car? I think it was like 300, okay, yeah, yeah, not so much. There's no rock chips on it, and that's the best time to do Thank it. God, yeah. Um, we wrapped the roof black, that came out really good. We got What's the, the name of the wrap? Sorry to cut you off no, for the roof. Good. So the roof is actually Steck Gloss Black uh, PPF. So it, it's a wet application, just like the clear PPF, uh, but the benefits of it is uh, the gloss levels are a lot higher than regular vinyl wrap and uh, it lasts a lot longer than regular vinyl wraps. Kind of tied everything together. We did the black mirrors, the black vents, the black spoilers. So now we, you know, we kind of have like, a little bit of gloss black everywhere. And I think, you know, it really breaks the car up, so. I was telling them that that wrap looks way better than paint, in my opinion. <laughs> I was, my dad's like, I showed him and he was like, that looks like yeah, paint. It's absolutely wild. And you know, you don't have any, uh, no orange peel or, you know, nothing you traditionally get with a uh, regular vinyl wrap. So. Guys, check out these lines. Like, <laughs> there's no bubbles in it or nothing. So you guys know where to go. Yeah, everything came out really good, man. You know, looks beautiful. Protection. We, did a, we did some high impact areas back here around the wheel. So, you know, if you hit the track or yeah. you're out racing or anything, you know, you're going to be protected and uh, that's that's really the the main the main part here so it was awesome to have it here in the clean room we actually had to turn the lights off because it was so bright. So i was gonna say i was like, getting blind in here the car the yeah zach was like going crazy and he was staring <laughs> at the light so he had to cut the lights off and um it's uh yeah it came out really good so the black wheels it all just flows and ties together i think a lot better now so yeah i'm happy with it, it looks awesome i appreciate it guys yeah, absolutely and what's your it's a plus, a plus auto, auto styling. styling we're in forest hill maryland we are right up the street from jake so uh northeast maryland a little under the pa line you can need protection window tint you know where to find us yes sir all right guys their link will be in the description so make sure if you want tint or ppf on the car Please go hit them up and tell them I sent you. Always helps out. Guys, I can't thank them enough. Look how good the car came out. It is perfect. Check out this blue tremor though. I'm actually digging this. I might take the tremor home instead of the Mustang. <laughs> Looks super clean. I love that blue. All right, guys, that is going to wrap up today's video of getting my 2020 Mustang GT back from Nick and the guys at A Plus Auto Styling. I can't thank them enough. The job they did is absolutely perfect. If anyone needs tent wrap, guys, please go hit them up. And I'm not just saying this just to say it. The work they do is perfect. Never had a problem. Everything's always done correctly, and if there's anything I find, they're gonna fix it for me, no problem. So if you're in the uh, Falston, like Maryland, Baltimore, anywhere DC, it's not that far of a drive. They're awesome people. Waiting room is super nice to chill, so don't have to worry about that. And yeah, that's gonna wrap up today's video, guys. I hope you enjoy. Please drop a uh, thumbs up and subscribe. We're about to flip 10K, so hopefully many more. And if you're new here, thank you for watching. I'm out.